We're living in a world of collective unease. As a society, we are more anxious than ever about politics, our place in the world, and the future. To allay some of those fears, the Saatchi Gallery is displaying 170 sculptures, installations, photography, and collages in a new exhibition called Black Mirror, Art and Social Satire. James Howard's work is an installation made up of 35 digital prints. Well, this work was made about 10 or 11 years ago and at the time it was an attempt to kind of harness a lot of the energy that was flying around particularly online in those days via links which I found in all sorts of spam emails and on lots of crazy corners of the internet and try to combine those things to release huge amounts of energy in artworks. James is fascinated by language. His reimagined spam contains numerous spelling mistakes, errors and inconsistencies. I wouldn't say it's design so much as a kind of an instinct. Um, I try to allow these things to take form because, you know, the material itself has certain kind of mysterious powers. When you're making art and you feel this sudden release of energy, you know it. And this is the sort of thing that I'm addicted to as an artist. Other notable pieces include Niagara Falls by Valerie Hegarty, a comment on environmental degradation, colonization and repressed histories. Wendy Mayer's incredibly lifelike doll sculpture. And this work, Introduction, by Dominic McGill, in collaboration with Turkish professor of Ottoman history, Murat Jem Menguk. We're trying to create a sort of like a contemporary history painting. So you're, we're taking quotes and images um, from hundreds of different sources, putting them together to create it's, it's, not, it's not a direct narrative, it's a, a narrative that you, you work your way through. For Dominic, the process of history itself is very ideological. He's interested in different histories that are associated with different cultures, how the Russian perspective differs from America, the Middle East or Africa. All the quotes are about, about how, how ideology works, how it um, informs us to, to live in a certain way without asking questions because we just assume that that's the way the world is. It's the man is a product of society and yet a society is a product of man and it's this endless circular argument. Black Mirror raises questions we can all relate to. What influence does political uncertainty have on our lives and on our sense of self? And what role should art like this play in commenting on divisive politics? Some of the work may be darker than others, but ultimately the Saatchi Gallery hopes these pieces will provide some sort of light relief in these unsettling times. Black Mirror is on show at the London Gallery until January. Miranda Atty, TRT World, London.